Those vegan guys. I thank you. And again, it's the first meal of another meal vlog. Very random one tonight. Um, we're trying the Aldi uh, Kievs, which we haven't tried before. But I've done creamy mashed potato with pan fried onion and sweet corn mixed into it. And then I've done a shredded cabbage and courgette mix with a little bit of sesame oil, black and white sesame seeds and some spring onion. Very random. I've got a cup of cut open the Kiev. Bromers. Best dad, aren't I? Bromers face. Hey, Bromers face. Hey, yeah. Hi. <laughs> Best dad, aren't I? Yeah. So this is the Aldi Kiev, isn't it? Yeah. I did them in the air fryers. I think they probably lost a bit of uh, butter air to pour a bit out of the tray at the end. Um, uh. it's, yeah, there's still some in there, but not very... Oh, yeah. They're okay. Have a taste. Have a taste, Bromers. I will. Burn me mouth. It's having a taste, Luke. It's having a taste, the lad. Will he like it? We don't know. Now, we've had M&S ones, Plant Pioneers ones. And I think these ones are... And I think that's it, isn't it? That's mm -hmm. the only three. That's lovely. Um, I think it's the softest outer right okay of all of the ones we've had so if um, for anyone who likes a Kiev that's got a bit of crunch and a, a bit of um, a bit of firmness to the firmness protein to it but I really like that it's very very tasty well good mm -hmm. uh, do you mind trying the veg mix and letting me know what you think oh, well, shredded cabbage just try it all yeah, try 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 the mash because we've never had it with pan fried uh, sweet corn and onion before. So I thought that'd be a, a nice taste sensation. And then the veg, for some reason, I just wanted to put sesame with. Oh, the mash is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I thought it might be. I'd, I had a flavour sensation Love in my brain waves from the um, sweet, sweet corn. corn. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then this, and that should have a slight Chinese. I put a little bit of Chinese five spice. A little bit of sesame oil uh, and black and white sesame seeds and then spring onion right at the end so it returns its crunch mm. Mm. nice really nice texture all of the flavors are coming through yeah good ah, yes yeah, taste well done mister there you go a delicious dinner of randomly <laughs> vegan kiev uh, a, a chinese inspired veg mix and as pause uh, Southern American mash. Yeah. Nice. Hello, my loves. We've just, uh, as you'll see on a future allotment vlog, we've just whipped down there and done a few bits. And uh, I just said to Jason, I really fancy noodles. So I've whipped up a quick noodle soup dish. Uh, this is a packet of... Um, packet of medium noodles kind of straight to wok ones from Sainsbury's but in the pan first I did some uh, uh, Sainsbury's um, chicken style pieces uh, I did some courgette some green pepper some edamame some shredded cabbage um, a green chili a couple of red chilies a teaspoon of chili oil some sesame oil some soy sauce <laughs> a stock cube a bit of chinese five spice and here we go beautiful beautiful soup noodles have a taste jane tell me what you think because i think i've nailed this what should i have a taste of taste the soup first Oh, and a hint of tomato puree, just a tiny bit, just to change the dimension of the flavour. Ooh. You like it? It's umptious. Yeah. Yeah. So, there you go. Lovely, lovely, gorgeous, soupy noodles. We've got chopsticks, and I think we might try. <laughs> and we're right going to enjoy this. Mm. Try it. Whack a load of stuff in a pan. Make your own little soup. Have some soupy noodles. It's dead easy. Dead delicious, dead good. Love you lords. Bye. For now. Good evening, my lovelies. It's Thursday evening. Jay's finished work for, and he's off. He's got Monday off as well. Yay! Yes. 
Now they say you eat with your eyes, for bugger's sake don't, not in this case. <laughs> this is one of those random dinners. We had some jackfruit bow buns and some no pork belly bites from Sainsbury's Christmas range, still in the freezer. So I've done a bit of rice with spring onion and a stir fry mix of red and white cabbage, courgette, cashew nuts, peanuts, chilli, bit of soy sauce. So it's a bit unsightly but it's going to taste good and it's made room in my freezer. I'm not going to lie to you, some of our meals look crap. This one included. Bye loves. It's Jason's Lunchtime Taste Tests. Okay, I'm in Boots for a meal deal today. Uh, let's have a look. Not a lot to go at today. It might be this. Vegan no chicken salad. Everything else is veggie or meat. And I don't fancy this at all. Although I know some of you have raved about it. So, I'm going to go for... This. I think I'm going to try these. Yes. And a juice. Nice and simple. Yeah, just a nice simple orange juice. And there we go. So I'll uh, check the sandwich out and uh, I'll be with you shortly. Okay, so the Boots meal deal, £3.39. Um, I may have had the vegan no chicken salad before. I'm not 100% sure, but I don't think I've ever done a taste test and vlogged it. Uh, so I'm gonna quickly have a quick check and bite on the old uh, sandwich. Uh, and I'm also gonna just have a quick taste test of the proper corn, peanut butter and almond popcorn, because I've never had this before either. So, um, vegan no chicken salad. Uh, seasoned wheat gluten and soya protein pieces with vegan mayonnaise, tomato, lettuce, cucumber and lemon juice on malted bread. Now, generally, I don't do particularly well with cucumber, um, but I think if it's in quite small quantities, which I'm guessing it will be on here, should be okay. So, without further ado, because I am at work after all, as you know, let's dive in. This is what it looks like. Mmm. You saw it in the shop though. There you go. Let's have a see what this tastes like. The bread, straight away, the bread is soft and lovely. And yeah, I can just tell already. Okay, I'm gonna dive in. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Tasty, refreshing, a little bit salty, lovely and fresh. Tomatoes are beautiful. Um, the uh, whatever you know, the uh, the no chicken, the protein element um, is really tasty as well. I'm just gonna have another bite. Mmm, yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. That's really good. Um, what have we got? Let me just check because I know some of you like to know this. I don't know if I can see easily on the packet how things break down. Well, oh, 18 grams of protein in this sandwich. That's pretty impressive. So 18 grams of protein right there. Okay, that's awesome. Would I recommend the Boots Vegan No Chicken Salad Sandwich? Absolutely. It's a great meal deal, it's reasonably priced, but of course, cost-wise, it doesn't even come close to the £1.75 um, frozen ready meals 
uh, from Aldi. Um, I've tried two now and they've both been really nice. Uh, so, okay. Proper corn, peanut butter and almond popcorn. Clearly marked vegan on the back, clearly marked gluten free, natural seasonings, popcorn seasoned with peanut butter and almonds. Uh, interesting as well, each of our packs has been illustrated by a different artist. Um, they have used their imagination and distinct style to express the flavour within. Find out more at popcorn.com. So there you go, not sponsored, of course. It's been ages since I've had popcorn. Ooh, smells nice. Hmm. Not bad. Really nice taste. Really nice taste. I'll be honest with you. As I always am. I could stand for it to be a little bit more peanut buttery. Um, and my personal preference with popcorn, I like popcorn that's, that's uh, got a bit more crisp to it. It's not massively crispy popcorn, but it still tastes really nice. And to be included as part of the meal deal for £3.39, um, it's pretty damn good. So, there you go. That's my, uh, that's my lunch for today. Um, do take care of yourselves, and uh, I will see you again very soon. Hello, my loves. It's Friday night. It's um, 20 to 8. We're live at 9 o'clock tonight, and we've been down to the allotment today, done... Uh, the first part of our uh, vlog 9 for plot 25 we've both just had haircuts <sighs> and we're looking much better well some might say we're looking <laughs> much better thanks very much uh, and tonight we're having uh, the clip well we're trying that um, scampi from Quorn for the first time with oven chips and a minted pea medley, which is a tin of mushy peas, an handful of frozen peas, spinach and mint sauce, it's right bloody posh, and a homemade tart sauce, mayo, Dijon, lemon juice, gherkins, capers. Lovely. Do you want to try one of them bits of scampi? Yeah, so Promise. these are the corn. New corn. New corn vegan scampi. Yes. I'll just have it as is. They're just going to bite it. Well, that's the way to go, isn't it, really? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Have a look at it. <laughs> it's quiet, that, isn't it? God, these phones are rubbish, man. Is this content? <laughs> <laughs> uh, very nice. Very nice. My brain's always slightly confused with um, with vegan scampi because when I bite into it, I think it's going to be like um, a no chicken popper or yeah, you know, something like that. And then it's that. different. But yeah, it's very tasty. Not, I, for me, my personal preference, not massively um, fishy, which is a good thing. Good. Well, we fish things up with that lovely. Well, not fish things up, but because it's got <laughs> lemon juice in it. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Anyway, chips, scampi, and a mushy pea minted medley. Hey, might see you live later. But you won't hear that until after the live. Oh, what have you done? It's all weird. Bye.